this is a case of ureteral vaginal fistula and here you can see that these are the delayed phases and you can see some contrast here which doesn't look like it is in the bladder we'll see it further so renal pelvis shows the contrast here these are the delayed phases and this is the bladder and contrast in the bladder and these are the ureters as we move down and trace the ureters we can see that right ureter is here and the left ureter is sort of irregular with some peritoneal leak of contrast there is periuretric contrast leak and this irregularity of the ureteric ball and this contrast pooling here is nothing but it's in the vagina so this is a post operative case following hysterectomy and these are the axial sections here we can see that again around the left ureter there is peritoneal leak of contrast this is the periuretric contrast leak and the ureter looks irregular with some leak of contrast here again in the pelvis in perivesical region and the so a thin track you can see not very well visualized but here now you can see this is the tract joining the ureter and the vagina it's an iatrogenic ureterovaginal fistula this is a 3d reconstruction of the same after doing the mip images we did the 3d reconstruction here you can see right ureter the contrast is not very well filled but the left ureter you can see the periuretric contrast and irregularity of ureter and this here foci whatever you can see that is the contrast within the vaginal canal here you, you can see that it's not within the bladder so that contrast which is not in the bladder is in the vagina and the tract is not well visualized in the 3d sections